Here, come over here, look at this. My elbow, my elbow comes in here to his hip. I don't whizzer. I don't put the hand to the near side. I just keep it here. Now, as he's trying to come through, I'm already making my angle to spin around the head. Here comes the spin. Fight towards me, Johnny. Hold that down. Get that gift wrap. Lock it up. Twist him. Get my chest to back connection. Push him. Sink back. Push him. Now he's balled up. He doesn't want to let me have the back. So I put my right leg up first. Then I'm going to sit him up on his butt, stand up, and then put the pressure while we're driving him forward. Check the choke. He can defend the choke. As he defends the choke, I put the hook. And now I fall to the side, lock my legs, or put my two hooks in. Now, John, you got to stop this, buddy. Come get the fingers. Try to. It's too late. It's too late. It's too late. It's too late. I'm in. Finish. What's up, John? <laughs> Teach me grappling, what's up? Look at the return of Jonathan Solar. If you guys don't recognize this guy, he was very famous on this channel back in the day. Uh, Brian Peterson, right here. Is that how I look That's when I wrestle? Yeah, okay. <laughs> kind of like That's that. That's how I look. Is that pretty accurate? <laughs> That's good. Like that, right? That's good. Right. Hey guys, check it out. You're down, you're down, you're down. We are doing some back take stuff, guys. Check it out. First things first, this side switch drill, we're gonna change it and take the back. So first, side switch drill. I'm here, John turns towards me, frames gets an underhook, I side switch. Look at that, I lost Jacob. And then I come into the over under like this, John turns towards me, I'm controlling him, he's trying to get up and get his underhook, I step around, I catch the over under, Modified Keskatomi right here. That's your basic side switch, switch drill. We're not doing that anymore. We're going to the back. So when I'm here, he frames. Notice my left leg is up. My right knee is jammed into his rib cage here. Okay, you can move around, Jake, Jacob, if you want to see. So I jam my knee right into here, and then I put this left leg up. Okay, now once I'm here, he's framing me. See that? So when he frames and he gets on his side, I'm, I'm just controlling right here. I've already broken my lock. John's gonna start pummeling. When he pummels, notice my elbows and my hands. I'm not gonna go wizard. I don't wanna open my elbow at all. I just wanna keep my elbow tight. Now, I'm leaning this way as I clear over the head. This time when I do it, instead of catching this arm in my armpit for the Keskatami position, we're gonna smash his arm with our body so as I drop this knee, and I go here, I'm smashing it with my body, and then my hands are free. My hands never touch the mat. I double up, and I just pin his arm down as I swing off the head. Once I do this, John's trying to turn back towards me, and I'm keeping his arm like this. Now next, you guys gotta learn this technique. Watch what I'm gonna do. If it's available, I will go for the gift wrap. If I can go here and here, I will. But if John's keeping it away from me, see I can't, like that, he's about to turn into me. I don't want his elbow to get back to here. That's what he wants. So while he's trying to bring himself, you know, basic hand oh. position, like back like that, I'm keeping pressure and look at my toes. Toes are in the mat. If I'm sprawled, he'll just turn. He'll fight and turn, you see that? So it's important that you have your toes in the mat. Toes in the mat, and then now, I push, and then I sink back. I rolling pin. I need him like dough. Sink back. Push, sink back. Now, you can see where I am. Right here, blocking the elbow, blocking this arm. Go behind the neck, get the wrist, pummel inside, get your gift wrap. Now we're ready for the back. Okay, but in the drill, I'm gonna release. Let John turn towards me. Fixing his position. I get my underhook, and now when I'm in position here, he's turning towards me with the frames, learning good discipline. John's trying to pummel the underhook. I'm gonna spin around. Are you ready to catch this, Jacob? Yeah. So you're gonna walk this way. Sure. I'm spinning around. As I do that, I'm pinning this arm. I'm here, John's trying to turn towards me. I wanna roll and get to here. There are many different ways, variations, how you're gonna do this. 
Sometimes you're going to roll him a little bit and then get it. Sometimes you will have him here. You didn't get the back perfectly and you're going to get the gift wrap first. And then once you lock it, then you're going to roll him. Smash, sink back, smash, sink back. Sometimes he'll turn into you and you'll, he'll expose his back too much and it'll be, it'll be so perfect. So turn towards me again. So here he goes, he turns, he turns, he turns, he fixes his elbows, fix your arms. I get the underhook. He's framing to get away. Notice my leg is up, so I'm a step ahead. I've got to be a step ahead. He's pummeling inside as I smash. Once he goes here and I spin, if he really turns on his side like this, he exposes his back. I want to glue myself to this. I want my chest glued to this. The more he's like this, the less likely I am to get this move. So when I spin, it's going to be harder to pin this down. But the more he turns, see if I use my chest, he's turning because he wants to get up. Now, when I go here, notice my chest is connected to his back. And now, you see, I can go get that gift wrap. See that? Sorry, John, I had to put the muscle on you, buddy. And yeah. then I go inside and I get the grip. Now, what do you do once you get here? How do you take the back? Because if, if he's a dummy, I just go like this. Watch. Uh, come over here so you can see the knee. Look. I throw my right knee here with my foot next to his back. See how, like, if you want to see it, like, here. See? Here, close. And then I just swing my leg over. Come back over here. When I swing my leg over, I, I'm shifting weight so my left leg is light and I swing and I bring my leg over here with my heel in. But the reality is, if I can get this, I can always sit, see that? So now my right leg can slide into the hooks. I'm not long enough for a body triangle, but come on over here, okay? So if you were, you could go body triangle, but you see, I can't really do that. So I might just stay like this or I'll go feet in the middle hooks as I go for the neck. But the reality is, you're probably not gonna get that on a good guy because he's gonna ball up. So when he balls up and you can't swing your leg over, you're always gonna have these problems, guys. This is really common. So I have my gift wrap, I'm in good position. I drop that knee, I pick this one up. Then I sit him up. I stand up on my feet. I don't like to be on my knees, guys. If I'm here and I'm on my knees, John can still fight me. He can move around. He can go towards his knees to one side or the other, you see, and create problems like this, or I'm on the bad side. So when he comes back, it's important that I stand up on my feet, my thighs are closing around his body, and I'm centering him, driving him forward, making him a yoga expert. And I drive him down like this so John's uncomfortable. How you feeling, John? John's having fun. John wants this video to be over so bad, guys. All right, so now I'm here. I'm gonna move myself a little bit to the side. John, can you go to your knees on either side? Can you go left or right? No. It's sad. really tough, right? Yeah. I walk around to this side. Now, John's gonna use his right hand to block my hook and also his right leg like this. Like, he's not gonna let the hook in. Don't let it. See, I can't put the hook, but what I can do is choke. When I start choking, I distract. That's when my hook goes in and I fall. You see that? So I have this two punch combo of choke and hook where he has to deal with the threat and one is gonna get him, or both. A lot of times you divide him so much. I go to the choke, he defends the choke, I get the hook. And then when I get the hook, I get the choke because now he's trying to defend the choke but it's too late. There's too many attacks coming through. I end up getting two hooks. I end up getting the whole ball of wax and we win. One last time guys. Take you through this whole move really quick. Okay, ready? Yeah. So, John's gonna be turning towards me from the classic side control position. He's pummeling his underhook. As he's coming through, he's framing, he's pummeling. Look at this detail right here. Come over here, look at this. My elbow, my elbow comes in here to his hip. I don't whizzer. I don't put the hand to the near side. I just keep it here. Now, as he's trying to come through, I'm already making my angle to spin around the head. Here comes the spin. Fight towards me, Johnny. Hold that down, get that gift wrap. Lock it up, twist him, get my chest to back connection. Push him, sink back, push him. Now he's balled up, he doesn't want to let me have the back. So I put my right leg up first, 
Then I'm gonna sit him up on his butt, stand up, and then put the pressure. Notice my feet in the mat, pushing really good. Just driving him forward, driving him forward. Check the choke. He can defend the choke. As he defends the choke, I put the hook. And now I fall to the side, lock my legs, or put my two hooks in. Now, John, you gotta stop this, buddy. Come get the fingers, try to. It's too late. It's too late. It's too late. It's too late. I'm in. Finish. That's it, guys. Pretty easy. Right, John? Yes, yeah, good. It was so easy. Were you able to cut it tonight? Like once. One time. One time. One time. In live training. Live. But guys, it's the first time he's really going through this sequence, and he was able to hit it on, was he a blue belt? Or yeah, white belt? Blue. He was like a blue belt. So, got to smack those blue belts up. I'm just kidding, guys. If you're a blue belt, smack the white belts up. All right, guys, teach me grappling. Hope you enjoyed. Please share this video. Back attacks are still coming. We got more back stuff. Um, this is really important. Side switch to the back control. When the guy turns into you, he exposes his back. Don't always try to push him onto his back. Let him come to his side. Instead of defending what he's doing, counter attack him and take his back. Okay. All right, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> I'll on see on you next there. time. Somebody Good. died Some, in the sauna. Somebody, Man I'm down getting, in the sauna, Brian. I'm getting distracted over oh, here. Oh, jeez. I hope All right, you guys. have an insurance policy. <laughs> Teach me grappling. I'll be back for more next time. With more great Passed stuff. Out. Go get that guy. He's, He's dead. dead.